Well, hello, my dear friends, and welcome back to Mountain Blade Viking Conquest, where we are on, if you would believe it, day 145. Nearly half a year since that fateful day when Sven Bullneck assaulted our ship on the way to Dakinga. Much has improved, and talking about recent times, we've had a pretty good couple of days. We've been made of vassal, we've got a flag, we've got a decent warband together. Of course, the parting was a little upsetting, but it had to happen, I think. And as much as it is sad to lose Bodo and lose Brunhild and lose Agathinos, you know, it's nice that we got some loyal fellas in Selwyn and Egil and that lot. And yeah, I think things are going to go quite well. Anyway, currently what we're doing is scouting. We are scouting Goban. We have now scouted Goban. And where were the other places? I've forgotten what they were called. It was, 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 was these ones. Sel Regimold and something else. The thing that was near Sel Regimold. Um, I've forgotten again. <laughs> what was it? Bal Regimon South and Sel Regimon Aid. Bal Regimon Aid South and Sel Regimon Aid. Okay, well they're up here, aren't they? There's Bal Regimon Aid South. And there's, oh god, there's a lot of regimonades, isn't it? Yeah, it's just these two, isn't it? So we'll head to Edinburgh, maybe have a recruit on the way, because the big, big objective of our current time is to take, I believe, Duntuar over there, that place. To do that, I said we'd need about 200. People in the comments have said I'm probably going to need about 300, so we'll set about getting about 300 men. It's going to be tough. We still can't, rec um, we still can't recruit in as many places as I'd like, but... You know, we're very rich right now. We've got, well, actually, that's not as much money as I thought we had. Of course, we're spending a lot on hiring men, aren't we? Who's that? That's, uh, that's, a, that's a friendly person. They're the right colour, anyway. Conagher? That means they're a king. Oh, good for him, Mr. King. Right, this is under siege, apparently. This area. Or is it not? It doesn't look... It doesn't look under siege, does it? Anyway, there's no recruiting to be had there. I guess we could spend the night there, but no, we're in a rush. We've got recruiting to do. We've got scouting to do. There's much to do. This is actually where we parked our ship. We could think about getting a bigger, better ship, couldn't we? Let's not worry about that for now. Let's just worry about what we've got to worry about. And of course, the big, big bad thing is the fact that Leondria seems to have gone missing. I don't know where he is. I... I, I just don't know where he is, you know? He was with us. I rechecked all the footage last time. He definitely didn't die. Do we need to sell any slaves? Yeah, he definitely didn't die. I checked for sure. Severe warrior. Uh, 10 for 5k. I shall hire you, boys. Lovely. Okay, right. Hopefully they're pretty decent. Well, that was all we went there for. But yeah, on the subject to Leondris, he he's definitely not dead, but he seems to have gone missing. So... Who really knows? Oh, look, Bjorn and half are both here. Anyway, we're going to just wait here until morning. Hopefully get that little bit of morale boost. Indeed, we have. Let's leave. Yeah, we'll find Leondrius one day. We'll find him. We'll find him. In terms of army now, yep, yeah, we, we're still Sphere Warrior. They do have shields. I like our team right now. It's still not nearly as big as it needs to be. We've got to think about a fight or maybe, actually, while we're here in Edinburgh. Let's think about productive businesses. Not sure if that is even a thing in this iteration of the game, but we shall endeavour to find out. Mm -mm -mm. So we're pretty well liked, apparently. We're quite indifferently liked, apparently. I thought we were pretty well liked, but whatever. Let's go to the map. This was pretty much the best fire, the best surefire way of getting money. Maybe we could buy a... A farmstead near this house. Very good, sir. We in the town know and trust you. I think I can find someone to sell you the land you need. There are a couple of things to keep in mind. Skilled foremen are always at a premium, so I doubt that you will be able to buy more land here. In order to make a profit for yourself, you should choose a commodity which is a relatively short supply. But for which the raw materials are cheap. A farmstead can engage in many economic activities, especially in enhancing production of local products. Okay. Well, I've always wanted to earn, uh, make a brewery. I think, um, let's see what we do here. I guess that would profit you 600 pennings a week. How much did it cost? Oh, God, are we going to have to go through lots and lots of clicking to do all of this? Right, so a mill and a bakery is 7k, and it'll net us 3.29 a week. Okay. Let's have a look at the others. Uh, so the brewery was... Oh, man, a ton of money. Okay, let's not worry about that then. 
Uh, let's have a look at foundry to make tools from iron. Will cost a real massive ton of money. And profit not all that much. At the moment, it looks like the uh, top option, the, what was it, the um, mill is the best option. Let's have a look at weavery. 16,000. Oh, my heavens above. Okay. And weavery to make linen. 18,000 to make... Okay, so we're looking at approximately 10 weeks to start making a proper profit. So let's have a look at the mill and bakery again. 3, 9. Let's, let's call that 400. I mean, it is the worst deal, isn't it? Profit will be 329. That is the worst deal. I think what we do is we save money and we just wait and then we buy something big. But it's good to know that we still got that option should we want that option. Anyway, let's crack on. Not really probably or not I can imagine much to do there. But there's something that we can go and maybe have a little loot off. It's a little bit of money. A little bit of a whatever there. Monastery. You know, we've gone down the route of... Who are these people? 97. That's someone we could beat up. Let's let's do avoid these chaps. If we can. Oh, Jesus Christ. They're pretty quick. Well, this isn't at all what I planned. Is there no way to avoid the battle? Why did they even give you that option? Anyway, 84 versus 160. You know, I'm feeling kind of confident about it. I've got to be honest. And what a victory it would be. Oh, let's do it. Let's do it. 160. We've all got to kill two men. If we all kill two men each, then we're good. Leondrius, can I see you? We've got a decent army now. Although I think if we just um, moved up to this point so that we don't have to fight up a hill, it might be a good idea. Okay, yeah, we got Finn Archers. We've got all of this and that and this and that. So, you know, this might not go badly. If everyone, as I said, if everyone can kill two people each, then we win. There they are coming down the hill there. I like our new helmet as well. I don't like the fact that I can't see the Andreas. We still have the option for him. But I don't see him. It's five for everyone. No, it's not. Oh, zero for everyone, isn't it? Yes, thank you, comments. Maybe we'll move a, just forward a little bit. There they are. They seem to just have lined up. Well, we're not gonna we're not gonna give up any ground here. Oh, man, we got a big ass shield ball here, haven't we? Why do the skirmishers go like that? I don't. I really don't know. Oh, they are coming. They are coming. Here they come, boys. Here they come. This is the one. If we can win this, it's going to be amazing. And I, you know, I have faith in our guys. You know, the last couple of battles that we've done have been very, very one-sided. Have they got some cavalry there? There seems to be a lot going way further forward than the rest. They must have maybe some cavalry. No, no, no. Just some what look like naked men, apparently. Okay. Let's see if we can get a lucky shot there. That was kind of hopeful, wasn't it? I love that our Finn archers are shooting already. You keep going, chaps. You keep doing what you're doing. Pretty good. Glad we spent the money on these guys. What are they doing? Oh, look. We're getting shot at as well. Starting a shield taunt. How on earth does one do a shield taunt? Seems to be going this way. How big is our shield ball, by the way? Well, the answer is half the size of the, of everyone else's. I feel like we might have to start moving forwards. Everyone. No point just getting shot, is there? But we need to keep our shield ball line, don't we? Do we charge or do we not charge? Ow. Ow. Hmm. They're not coming for us. I'm not going to stand here and get shot. Let's go. Let's go. Let's do this. Let's do this. For Sparta. For Leondrius. Wherever in the world he may be. Oh, God. That horseman's not going to fare too well, is he? Let's do this, lads. Let's do this. As I said, if everyone can kill two people. That's it. Right. Obviously, we're getting our... Hey, God. They're, they're weak. They're just a team of farmers. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, indeed. Just a team of farmers. 
Why were we ever worried? 160 and what? This is a professional warband that we got here. We're, we're actually an army with a flag. What are you going to do, lads? We're exhausted now. Okay, this is a fantastic, fantastic turn of events. Except for, unfortunately, that guy who's not going to be able to revel in our victory because he'll either be sporting a nasty wound or whatever. Yes, this is this is going exceptionally well. I am chuffed to buggery. Oh, what a day. What a day for the Merry War Band of Davnar. Yes, sorry, mate. I just hit on you. Is that Angle Peasant still alive? No, this is an unsavory chat. There we go. We, we got a hit on him. We dealt eight damage. You know, don't scoff at my eight damage, lads. Oh, someone's got him. Good job. Good job that's someone. And we're not exhausted anymore. See if we can get our... Oh, he's down. Who was that? It was actually someone. It was actually a someone. Mate, who says we need 300 men to take a city? Look at this. What a performance. Oh, my heavens. That is just amazing. The peasant women still going strong. See, now this situation is where we really need Leondrius. Because he can just hunt down. But wherever he's gone, as long as he's happy. You know, maybe he found a lady dog and, you know, his situation is just improving. Oh, man, I feel strong again. I feel strong. We got one kill, although we are exhausted. Yeah, stamina we still need to work out. Hopefully we get a level up for this. What a performance. No one messes with Davgnar in the team anymore. Man, I am so proud of every single one of our guys. How did we pull that off? Outnumbered, outflanked, that yet still we triumph. What a tremendous, tremendous, tremendous day it is in the grand story of Davgnar. What a tremendous day, my friends. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Man, look at us. Oh, Sven Bullneck, who? Who's this guy, Sven Bullneck? Have him at us right now. We can take on the world. Oh, well done, everyone. That was exceptional. <laughs> right, so who, how many did we lose? Seven. Okay, I think we can take that. Who who were those seven? One Sviar Warrior, which is disappointing. Three North, three whole. Okay, so we, we, we lost some good people. Oh, no, our Hornman died. Ah, uh, anyway, we've taken ourselves a prisoner and we got an epic trophy. <laughs> okay, the other guy escaped. Um, who looks the most expensive here? Noble, I assume. If any uh, elite, they've got the word elite. In fact, we've got 33 prisoner capacity. We could probably take a lot of these. We'll take everyone that has the word elite in their name. And then I would imagine a warrior, surf, or they're naked. So I can't imagine they're too expensive. Spin and we'll take... In fact, can we just take everyone? No, not quite everyone. We'll, we'll take, we'll fill up with these guys. Get back to Edinburgh and get them sold. Right, so we've got a young warrior to go into a slave hunter. And Sailor Wind's ready to upgrade. Well, that is fantastic. We'll share the loot as it's common. A um, couple of people were saying, do I want to maybe put some thought into upgrading my companion's equipment? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Only, only when it's needed, though. So we'll take that. In fact, we could probably give two of them to people. Uh, cracked helmet with mail. We've been upgrading their helmets already, and these shields seem pretty, pretty rubbish, to be honest. So we won't bother with that. Okay, good. Should be some morale. 600 quid. More soldiers to upgrade. Sailor win. Another slave hunter. A Norse freeholder who's going to become a Norse companion or a spearman. We've already got some spearmen. Let's have a look at the troop tree again. So companion eventually makes them bodyguards. I think maybe we'll go one, one and one. So next time we'll make a spearman or something. Well, that was just a fantastic performance. Sailor win. You've already got some good equipment, but let me at least see your skills. Uh, you're just a kind of bog standard fighter. So how about you have some power strike and some iron flesh and then some one handed ability about yourself. Good lad. And that was that. Okay, so Solvig probably needs an upgrade. Egil looks pretty upgraded. Asbjorn could do with a lot, actually. He's more than just a healer now. He needs to fight as well. So we'll give him this. And apparently you need boots as well. Actually, that bunk... That, that, that monk room's actually pretty solid, isn't it? Okay, yeah, you know what? Stick as you are, mate. Except there's no point you having a shield, except you fit in the shield wall. No, it just encumbers you. You're a you're a ranged person. Okay, well, Helgi uh, could probably do with some stuff. Yeah, 18-7. I think, I think that beats what you had, sir. And your shield's kind of rubbish. It's still, that's pretty good. Keep your hat. I like the hat. And then who else? Solvig. 
Probably needs a bit of an upgrade, don't you? 39-4 versus 30-13. Pretty simple. And then you've got javelins and a war spear, and you're pretty sorted. So this is our trophy. Very nice. And an epic. So we actually got two. Man, that's amazing. Okay, anyway, let's go loot ourselves a monastery. A really, really good event for us there. Uh, Kingdom of Lagan, and doesn't concern us that, does it? And that doesn't concern us either. Okay, well, still, just what a day. What a day! No one messes with Davnar, except an army of that many very well might. They're running away. It's all fine. They can't catch us. So, on to the Monastery of Apurnathage. Well, you know, we've been smacking up monasteries all the time. Let's smack up another. The only one we won't touch is Linda's Farm and any others that are in... What's it? Yeah, these priests ain't going to stand a chance. Yeah, the only monasteries we're not going to touch are obviously the ones in Northumbria. And Northumbria is a predominantly pagan land anyway, so... Our actions here will not have negative effects with our uh, diplomatic bonuses in Northumbria. And everyone else hates us everywhere else anyway. That's something we had to deal with long ago. It's something I'm now at peace with. So, yeah, really, really good situation for us. Why have I got the camera angle like that? I don't really know, to be honest, but these Finn archers are all for the Christian slaying, apparently. Look at them go! Look at them go! I kind of want a berserker just to catch up with them. Amazing, amazing stuff. Well, let's do this. Let's berserker. We can't berserker. Can we not berserker against monks? Probably not. Kind of unsurprising. Let's let's go proper Vikings and use Ragnar Sayaxa. Yeah. I don't even think that was our kill, but whatever. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. How do... Ah, we killed him with a shot to the bum. Ah. Oh. Right, come here then. Come here, you two. What? Oh, no, we missed. Ha! Ha! My goodness me. Some of the army that we were fighting last time aren't as good as these monks. Great job, that camp woman. Great job, everyone. Awesome job. Awesome job. So this should... Sorry, we won't take any monks as prisoner. This should sort us out for food. Yep, few apples. Have some smelling pork in recompense. What do we got there? Some chicken. Some chicken. Some... Not, not the best loot we've ever taken from a monastery, I'll be honest. But, hey, food is food, really, isn't it? And we do have a hell of a lot of it. And fruit. Lovely. Okay, good job. Blood and treasure, 360. A lot of ple a lot of places dislike that, but pff, whatever. Anyway, so Balric Monade and Selric Monade are the targets right now. And then maybe we can go and, I don't know, beat up some quarrymen or something. Hang about! I just saw them a little late. Uh, the Jarl Halfdan Ragnarsson has decided to convert Marshal Ship to Sar Jarl Sid Sidrock. I thought that had already happened. Maybe they're just reaffirming it. How many, how many people were there, as a matter of fact, in that army? I didn't see, but if it's, you know, like 200 or fewer, we'd probably take them. Probably take them. Oh, they seem to have disappeared. Did they fall into the river? Maybe? They've just totally gone. Oh, no, there they are. And it's 242. That's a big ask, you know. The way we dealt with it last time, I would feel pretty confident. Not the hell of that guy. Jesus Christ, that is a big force. Oh, it's half done. How you doing, man? How's it going? Ambion. Mate, they're wrecking on these mothers. Right, so is that a... Uh, you know what, if we can... Lads, do you, do you, do you fancy it? Do you, do you fancy having a crack at this area? Men need rest or morale will suffer. Well, as it would. Well, this is just tremendous. Look at them go. Hey, that's a succeeded quest. So we need to go and find Sidrock. We'll go and find, speak to half them while we're here. How's it going, guys? If it isn't my brave champion, Davnar. So you cross swords with the rascal they call? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, right. I hadn't realised we hadn't asked him already. I don't... Uh, who should receive the fight of Don Siesta? We don't even want that. But does he have any task minor errands that I would not put to you? If you're looking for action against our foes, you may try venturing to somewhere. Okay, well, the ability to recruit more is very good. And I think that's what we do. We go and we find... Uh, just checking. My most sincere apologies, friend. A phone call. And it wasn't one I could pass up. I have important phone calls sometimes. But here we go. So uh, just checking that we've actually scouted where we had to scout. Uh, talk to Yasigrok for our incredibly large reward. 